Hello there, welcome to this vlog and the start of my vlogmas. So the start of me participating in vlogmas and kind of putting my spin on it a little bit. I'm sure other people have done it the method that I'm planning to do it, but just in case. So as you might be able to tell from the title of this video, I have the plan to try and do vlogmas again this year. I have tried doing vlogmas. I want to say, mm, I want to say I've tried doing vlogmas twice and after like three days I'm just like never mind I can't do this. So my my thought, well actually let me back up. If you don't know what the vlogmas is, it's pretty much people vlogging every single day from like December 1st until Christmas. I have found that I can't do that. I just don't have one, that of excited of a life to showcase for you all, that me doing anything. Like so far this vlog's not even that exciting, but that's beside the point. So like that's the standard vlogmas. And on top of just like not being really excited, I found that I can't film an entire day, edit it, and then try and get it up like on the day that I film it. So that's just not gonna work. So instead I'm gonna do like the 12 days of vlogmas, which is basically gonna be every other day leading up until Christmas. So we are gonna start, technically this video plan is to go up December 1st. Spoiler alert, I'm recording this November 30th to like jump start into it. So that is the plan. I'm looking really rough right now. And I just look, I look so pale. <laughs> anyway, that's off topic. But yeah, so technically this is day one of Vlogmas, day one of the 12 days of Vlogmas however you want to put it. So my thought is why my hair is being weird. For those that don't know, we're building a new house. Our original like closing date for the house was like December 10th. It got moved to December 19th. Well now it's been moved to January 6th, which means I can decorate for Christmas now. Cause at first I wasn't going to cause I was like, well, what's the point? We're just going to have to move right before Christmas. There's really no point in decorating. Well, now that we're not moving until January, I can at least decorate a few things. So started off the day not feeling like super great. I just was really exhausted. So I just laid down for about 45 minutes, but now feeling a little bit better. I think while it's still light out, I'm gonna pull the like Christmas tree that I have down from the attic. I don't have a big Christmas tree. I am very excited for next Christmas because I plan to get a big Christmas tree. This tree, very, very skinny, not that tall. I think it's like barely a little bit taller than me. But I'm like, I'm gonna pull that down from the attic. I'm gonna pull some decorations down. And in the process of decorating, I can at least go through my decorations and be like, ooh, I don't want that anymore. And in the process of decorating, I can also declutter, kind of a win-win. And then later, Luke's at the gym right now. Later, we're gonna go to the grocery store. I normally like to get my errands done during the day, but I have learned when it comes to groceries, I actually don't mind going later, especially since it's a Saturday today. I don't mind going later because a lot of people don't go Saturday evenings like late Saturday afternoon, Saturday evening, people don't go to the grocery store. It's kind of the same with Fridays. Everyone wants to spend their weekends like away from doing that kind of stuff. So that's what we're gonna do later is go to the grocery store. So again, not that exciting of a first day of Vlogmas, um, but I figure I can pull the Christmas tree down and I can put some ornaments on it. And at the same time, do a little bit of decluttering because I'll be like, well, now I have the decorations down. Might as well go through them and see what I want to actually take with us and put out here. So that's what I'm gonna do now that I'm up from my 45 minute nap. So I just realized that the main Christmas boxes that I used last year and need this year were out in the garage, not in the attic. So I just pulled all those boxes out for nothing because these are the boxes I want, especially this one. And that's the tree. <sighs> well, at least I got the stuff out of the attic now. That's the Christmas tree. That's all the stuff I used in the past. This is stuff that I'll probably toss. I'm out of breath now.
Yeah, it's like barely taller than me, not by much. Also, I totally put on a lip gloss and I forgot that it was a lip plumper and now my lips look absolutely wild. Like I started tangling because of the plumping and I'm like, oh gosh, <laughs> I forgot they did that. Anyway, so there's something festive, yay. Okay, and here's the bin of things that I regularly use. However, I don't know if I'm gonna keep everything in here. Like this is cute, but I often can't find a spot for it. Same for this. I just got them because they were really cute one year. I don't know if I'm keeping them. This one, he is my favorite. He's not going anywhere. I love him so much. He's got to stay. He's not in focus, but there. He has to stay. He's my favorite. I'm gonna put him on this table for the moment because he'll like fit in with the vibe. All right, we just got back home from the grocery store and this was a pretty big grocery haul for us. Hopefully it'll last us a while, but I actually had some recipes that I wanted to try this week. One was like a, a burger bowl instead of like a burger with a bun. It's just the innards of a burger minus the bun in a bowl. Wanted to try that. Then I got some stuff for breakfast. Like I make a breakfast sandwich sometimes and it consists of like English muffin, American cheese. Yes, don't anyone come for me. American cheese. These sausage patties. I actually made it in the beginning clip for this vlog. I'm pretty sure. And then egg. So got some more of that. But then I also want to do avocado toast again, which I'm just now realizing we didn't get bread. That's okay. It'll be fine. But when I do avocado toast, I'm very lazy. I'm not going to go out and buy a whole avocado and try and mash it. So instead, I'm going to get the holy guacamole minis. They're just like little containers. Uh, you can kind of see it in there. Uh, but that's all I do is just take one container, split it in half. So one piece of bread gets one half, one piece of bread gets the other. Then I fry an egg and then I use a balsamic vinaigrette, which I also got more of that tonight too. It's like a balsamic glaze. So yeah, got some stuff for breakfast. Got my standard snack, which is red pepper jelly and brie. Love this combination so much. And sometimes I'll eat it with crackers, sometimes I'll eat it with apples. But yeah, and then for the burger bowl, I just picked up like this burger sauce because all the recipes were like, make your own. And I'm like, no, I'm not doing that. Not doing that. So got burger sauce. And then I also got a garlic aioli. I have another idea of something I want to make. Also got some rolls, some of these like smaller rolls to go with some ham. I don't know what Chester just did, but he ran away. Make little ham rolls. My mom made some uh, the day after Thanksgiving and they were delicious. Ground beef for the burger bowls. Hopefully I'm in focus. The lighting is kind of bad in here. Alexa, turn on kitchen. She doesn't know what I said. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> My AliExA never knows what I want from her. I just realized like the light. Oh, it's offline. Why is it offline? Hello? That's why it's offline. Someone flipped the switch. Got Luke a pizza for like the days when I'm in class. We're trying really hard to not door dash so often. Easier said than done. For Monday, usually Mondays after class, I am just, just exhausted. Tuesdays I'm still exhausted, but Mondays for some reason exhaust me even more. So we always like to go with Stouffer's meals. I don't think we've ever tried the chicken enchiladas. They're also gluten-free. Neither one of us need to be gluten-free, but it's just kind of cool thing, so. We're gonna do that Monday. I think we'll do the burger bowl tomorrow. And then there was another like little wrap thing that I came across where it's like chicken strips. And I just, I ended up getting like these pre-cooked ones. So all you have to do is like put it in a microwave. But this, with this on a wrap, pretty good little meal. Yeah, that's pretty much it. We did get some of these as well. It's like fully cooked. You just have to like, heat it up, but I used to, back when I worked at the college that I used to work at, would make scrambled eggs and put some of these in there, as well as cheese. That was a delicious meal. But yeah, so like we do the patties for the sandwiches, this for scrambled eggs. Did also get two dozen eggs and then some coffee. So grocery haul. Of course, now the problem is finding space in the fridge and the freezer for all of this. Oh my God, how could I forget like the best part? I found this creamer. It's Starbucks is like non-dairy, almond milk and oat milk sugar cookie latte. I'm so excited to try this. We're not gonna talk about the fact that one tablespoon is five carbs, but I'm gonna just put like a little bleh in there. A little bleh. I mean, I guess that's what a tablespoon is, but whatever, it's fine. It brings me joy. Also that really 
sad moment when you start putting your new groceries away and you have an entire trash bag of old food that you need to toss out. That's kind of sad. All of that is old stuff. There was some cheese in there from March. What? Mm. The lighting in this kitchen is not stupendous. But anyway, for dinner tonight, we just picked up because we knew we'd be tired after grocery shopping. So we picked up like these cooked chicken pieces and I think we'll just heat them up and add whatever sauce we want to them and that's gonna be dinner. Maybe with some chips. Not exactly healthy, but you know, whatever. We're tired. Also, exciting. Came in the mail today, my clean skin club. These are like the towels. So like these things where it's like the the disposable towels so like if you don't know what these towels are instead of like drying your face like after you've washed it with a regular towel that you would toss in the wash because despite the fact that you know you wash your towels there's still bacteria on them these are disposable towels so like you wash your face you dry your face with these and then just toss them which helps keep bacteria off your face so like it helps with acne or anything like that so i have absolutely loved these so far um so this is my my order that just came in it's two boxes of 50 each so i think it's it's 100 of these towels and they're pretty big towels like sometimes i'm like i feel bad only using one towel or like just using one towel to dry my face i'm like i feel like i should like save these because they're huge but yeah that's what that's what these are. They're really good. Um, so highly recommend. They are in my Amazon storefront if you wanna go like check it out. Now that I have eaten a little bit of dinner, I'm gonna go through this and see if there's anything else that I wanna put out. Also, I moved the light that usually is where the Christmas tree is over there and I kind of like it. It gives a little bit better glow in here, but Santa hats, I'm probably gonna toss. This I'm probably gonna toss. I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. Glitter anything, never a good idea. Again, these trees, they're cute, but like not really my vibe. Now this, this goes on the mantle. I need to put that up. Also, I already put the stockings up. I wish I had like another nail to do that. I don't have a hammer. I guess that looks fine as it is. I was put that nail back but like that looks okay also i don't know if you can see the pumpkins but there are still pumpkins down there ignore them yeah just just ig ignore ignore them they're gonna go to storage so i'll probably end up putting ornaments on this tomorrow so that'll be the second vlogmas vlog day two of 12 is decorating this and then doing something else because i do not feel like going through that right now. I just wanted to get a few decorations out today. Maybe do some more in the next one. I actually think I'm gonna go ahead and just end this vlog here. Since we're gonna be doing at least 12 days of this, uh, I wanna get started on editing so I can get this uploaded and not fall behind. So I'm gonna just go ahead and end this here. I hope you enjoyed day one of Vlogmas. I'm really excited to do this. I hope it gets me in the spirit because I'll tell you one thing, I was not in the Halloween spirit this year. I don't know what was wrong with me, but I just could not find the spirit of Halloween. So I'm hoping with vlogmas it'll help me find the spirit of christmas i do think us not moving now or not closing on the new home until december 6 december 6 january 6 kind of helps it gives me one more year to celebrate the holidays in this house i've been here since it was built in 2016 october of 2016 is when or was it september i don't remember uh was when closed on this house moved in in october of 2016 so i've been here for eight years. Luke has been with me here for two years. So I've spent a lot of time at this place. So it's kind of nice that I get to celebrate one last holiday here without needing to move right at the holiday. So that's exciting. But I'm gonna go ahead and wrap day one of Vlogmas up here. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to go down there, hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. So YouTube will let you know when I, the next video is up. But until the next one, Bye lovelies. Mm -hmm.